Marion girls are recovering from bad injuries after a head on crash at Oakview Mall on Saturday night. Tonight, the 16 year old is talking about the terrible collision while the search for the other driver goes on. New tonight, reporter Miranda Christian on the frightening experience. Miranda. I spoke with Maddie Reed today. She is out of the hospital, but she has a long road to recovery and she's hoping the man behind this accident is found. It was supposed to be a quick trip to the food court at the Oakview Mall. And right when we came around the curve, Sydney yells, Maddie, and then two seconds later, it just smashed into me. Maddie Reed's car was hit head on, leaving her and her friend nearly trapped. Reed says she saw a man with a mustache sitting behind the wheel of a large white utility vehicle. She says he and his passenger disappeared. Me getting out of my car mainly was when it hit me and I just broke down. Reed's grandmother, Joan Reed, says she raced to the accident after a hysterical call from Maddie. When I saw the car, when I saw the, you know, the impact and the condition of the car, all that went through my head was I, I can't even believe that these two girls are still alive. Days later, Reed is at home with a shattered heel and a fracture in her back. Her friend is still at Nebraska Medicine in the ICU. Nice and bruised. Reed is fighting a lot of pain and isn't very mobile. I'm okay now. I mean, I'm mainly just irritated and mad that it happened and that the guys got away. Her grandmother doesn't understand how someone could have just left the accident. I'm still pretty angry, you know, that how could anybody leave two beautiful young girls trapped and injured. For Maddie, the road to recovery will take a lot of opportunities away. I was supposed to be walking in Omaha Fashion Week um, dance team. I'm going to be sitting out of for a while. But through the accident, she's kept her spirits up, and it's now all about her and her friend getting better. She said she's going to be okay. She knows I'm going to be okay. I know she's going to be okay, so it's all that matters now. Reed says she'll vi visit the doctor tomorrow to find out when she'll have surgery on her foot, but it may be before this summer before she's walking again. She says through this all she's through all of this. She's so grateful for everyone who's come to visit her in the hospital and at home. That support just means the world to her. We're putting live. I'm Miranda Christian KMTV Action 3 News. We wish her the best. Thanks.